everyone welcome to the pink moon tarot um today i'm going to do a walkthrough of a deck that i've had for a while now um but it is i have to say probably my favorite deck to use and the other day i went through the muse tarot because um this was my this was my deck that i absolutely adore and so i bought the muse tarot who is by the same person by chris ann um just to see what it was like and I love that one too. So anyway, I thought since you've seen me use this deck many, many times, you might like to see what it looks like in totality. So this is the Light Seer's Tarot by Chris Ann. It's a very nice chunky box. That's the back of the box there. And it is available on Amazon um, as well as other places inside you get a really nice book with this one it's really chunky nice sized book um if you look at it up against my hand you know it's it's a good size it's just a bit bigger maybe than a regular tarot uh, regular card deck rather and the guidebook is lovely it comes um you know it says working with healing um, working and healing with the Lightseer's Tarot. Then it has Tarot Basics for the new card slinger, um, the Major Arcana, the Minor Arcana described, a note on uprights and reversals, connecting with your cards, um, reading and spreads. So it's got the spreads and the readings. And then it goes into the Major Arcana, which it has a little picture and a two page description. Um, they are black and white pictures. And then it goes into the minor arcana with the pictures and the descriptions. And I think that's it in there. Yeah. So, and then there's a little section about Chris Ann at the back. So it's a really nice little guidebook, that one. And as you can probably tell, I've looked in it quite a few times. So then inside of the box looks like this very pretty it's a beautiful color it's a nice sturdy box as well which i like so without further ado let's get into the cards themselves so we start as always with zero the fool i love this fool card she's really beautiful and then we have the magician and the high priestess Then we have the Empress. Sorry, I'll try not to cover up where it says the actual thing. The Emperor. The Hierophant. It's probably my favorite Hierophant. The Hierophant in other decks does scare me a little bit, but this one, I like him. And we have the Lovers. And the Chariot. Isn't that beautiful Chariot? and strength again gorgeous artwork we have the hermit the wheel of fortune justice she uses a lot of mirror images like this or he I don't know whether Chris Ann is a, a male or a female, to be honest. I think it's a woman. Um, then we have the Hanged Man. And we have Death and Rebirth. Temperance. The Devil. And I've got to say, if this guy showed up as the Devil, I'd be tempted to. Whew. <laughs> the Tower. The star, probably one of the most beautiful star cards. The moon. Again, beautiful moon card. The sun. Judgment. The world. So that's your major arcana, 22 major arcana cards. And then we go into the minor arcana. And we start with the ace of wands. I 
couldn't remember which way around I put these. The two of wands, the three of wands. I do love this three of wands. The four of wands, the five of wands, the six of wands, the seven of wands, the eight of wands, my warp speed card, the nine of wands, the ten of wands, and we have the page of wands, so much joy in that card, the knight of wands, the queen of wands, again just joy in these cards, and the king of wands, he's a handsome devil too. And then we go on to the ace of cups, the two of cups, the Three of Cups, it's possibly one of my favourite Three of Cups cards. The Four of Cups, the Five of Cups, the Six of Cups, the Seven of Cups, the Eight of Cups, the Nine of Cups. Look at the joy in that. And the Ten of Cups. I mean, this deck is just filled with such beautiful imagery that really, it's just gorgeous. And we have the Page of Cups. And the Knight of Cups. Mr. Smooth. <laughs> the Queen of Cups. And the King of Cups. And we have the Ace of Wands, the Swords, sorry, the Two of Swords, the Three of Swords, the Four of Swords, the Five of Swords. I love how she uses birds to represent the swords. The, um, what have I got to? The Six of Swords. The Seven of Swords, hope the light's not reflecting too much. The Eight of Swords, there's that mirror image again. The Nine of Swords, the Ten of Swords, and the Page of Swords, the Knight of Swords. The Queen of Swords, she is my favourite Queen of Swords, without a doubt. I mean, she just looks so cool. And the King of Swords. And then we have the Pentacles. So we have the Ace of Pentacles. The Two of Pentacles. The Three of Pentacles. Try not to get the light reflecting. It's only my overhead light. The Four of Pentacles, the Five of Pentacles, the Six of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. It's such a beautiful card. And the Page of Pentacles, the Knight of Pentacles, the Queen of Pentacles, she's so beautiful, and the King of Pentacles. And that is your Lightseer's Tarot deck. Now, the cardstock for this, like I say, it's slightly bigger than an um, than an average card deck, ordinary, you know, aces, um, clubs, queen, uh, clubs, hearts, spades, and diamonds. Yeah, that, that's what I mean when I say ordinary card deck. 
Um, so it's slightly bigger than an average one. It's, uh, it's a good size deck. If you have slightly larger hands, obviously you like to have something a bit better to hold. It's very smooth, but matte, you know, um, well, not matte so much, but more, it's got a slight sheen to it, but it's not glossy. It's, uh, it's that silk finish. If it was a paint, it would be a silk. And to shuffle, very, very easy. I mean, they shuffle like a dream and they have done from day one. And this deck is just, well, it's probably my favourite deck. I just adore this deck. I've connected the most with it and I really enjoy using it. So that is the Lightseer's Tarot by Chris Ann. who, yes, is a female. I thought she was. And um, there's a picture of her on the back of the book there. Okay, so I'll leave that there. And um, if you if you want to order the deck, um, like I say, it is still available on Amazon. It's a Hay House um, production. And um, I'll put a link in the description box below if it is an affiliate link. So if you do order through Amazon, you know, and if enough people do, then I do get like a little bit of money off of it. It doesn't affect the price for you, but it may um, it may actually pay me at some point um, for you ordering through my link. So just to be aware there. But you can get this in most places, not just Amazon. It's in um, quite a lot of the bookshops and um, and other places like uh, Book Depository. You can probably get it on eBay. I don't know. I must confess I've not looked on eBay for this one because I had this one from Amazon. Um, but, uh, but yeah, so it's available all over the place. And it is absolutely stunning and I can't recommend it highly enough. Okay, have a great day. Namaste.